so I'm gonna try something new today and because I can't find my other pair of 2.25 millimeter magic loop knitting needles the only other thing I have is DPNs and nine inch circulars and my hands are way too big for the nine inch circulars. So we are going to try to cast on a sock with DPNs today. So if you didn't know, DPN means double pointed needles. So there's no stopper on either side of these. It's a needle on both sides. I have never, oh, one's bent pretty good too. Never used these, but somehow they got bent from the time I bought them until now. That makes total sense. I have moved, I've moved five times in five years. Wow, that's a lot. <laughs> I have never knitted a sock, nor have I attempted to even cast on a knit sock with double pointed needles, so this is going to be fun. <laughs> I only ever use Magic Loop. I just find that to be the easiest, especially as a somewhat new sock knitter. I've only been sock knitting for like four-ish years. So I've just found that that is the easiest way, but I can't find my other 2.25 millimeter Magic Loop. So we're gonna do this. Let's get to it. Okay, so we have our five double pointed needles or DPNs. These are size 2.25 millimeter, so same as the Magic Loop knitting needles that I use, and you're going to need five of them because you're going to have four of these with active stitches on them, and then you're going to have one that you're going to be knitting with. But from the videos that I watched, you like knit onto a needle and then the act, the one that you just knitted with goes onto those stitches and then you have the one that you just knitted the stitches off of. Hopefully that made sense. We're gonna be using this yarn today from Michaels. Just gonna, I just kind of wing it and then I usually have a ton extra to sew in but it's better to have too much than not enough, so. We are going to make a knot, and that's gonna start our first stitch here. All right, so you have to split your amount of stitches into, so the total amount that I do when I knit a sock is 72 stitches. So you have to divide that by four. So that is gonna be 18 stitches per needle. So start one. Two, three. This is the easy part, only using one needle. <laughs> Six. It is so awkward with these, but next we have to cast on to our next needle, and then eventually they're going to like make a square. So they're going to be like this. Okay, so. I'm going to try just kind of like holding the needle next to this one. Uh, let's maybe go up like that. One, two, three. Okay, that works. Four. So I'm pushing the one that I'm casting on the stitches up a little bit. And that seems to work okay. I also do the German twisted cast on, so that can make casting on to DPNs a little bit more difficult, but it makes the cuff of your sock a lot stretchier. Oh crap, I wasn't counting. Hold on. 15, 16, 17, 18. Okay. Now I gotta push this way. Okay. So then I have two done. But I need to push them back this way to add another one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Ugh. 
Hold on. Me. This is gonna start getting extremely awkward. Just, just, I just, there's so much happening right now. <laughs> okay, what if I just hold it like that and bring, like I was doing, okay, okay, okay. So, one, two, three, four. There is so much happening. Um, so we got our square, I guess. I'm so confused. Hold on. All the stitches are facing towards the middle, so nothing's twisted. Now it's just figuring out how to hold it. Um... This is really awkward. I don't understand this. Got two knit stitches done. Two pearls. How am I supposed to hold these? These are gonna be vanilla socks, by the way, because there's no way I am trying to, ah! Okay, let's go on to the second needle. Yay! You gotta start with a pearl. Yay! Okay. Knitting in general, I've been knitting for a long time almost as long as I've been crocheting for. And it's just so awkward in my hands. Okay, this is too long. I should not be ending with knit stitches. That doesn't make any sense. Like, this is a mess. This is a mess. Like, I'm already all t No. Nope, we're not doing this. I give up. <laughs> See, that's the thing with knitting, especially if I find something and I'm not liking it, I am not going to enjoy the project. So we are just going to order a new pair of 2.25 millimeter knitting needles off of Amazon and start this sock when we get here. Cause the only other one that I have available is the one that I'm knitting the other one of this with. So that's the only other pair of knit, knitting needles that I have besides these. And then I have nine inch circulars, but nine inch circulars are, they're awkward in my hands like these are. It's not the same, but I just, with the size of my hands and stuff, and then like having to, it's too much. It's too much. So I am going to put in an order for a new pair of 2.25 millimeter knitting needles and these are just going to go back in my box of knitting needles just to use at some point for something other than sock knitting probably. So these are going to be the needles that you want if you want to do magic loop. They are the, I'm going to butcher the name, Chagu. I get them off Amazon. But they're 2.25 and it's two needles on one continuous loop and it is literally will make your life so much easier if you're trying to learn how to knit socks. So 
they are off of Amazon and I will link them down in the description below. If you guys liked watching me struggle trying to use DPNs, um, please consider subscribing to the channel and do all the YouTube things and we'll see you in the next video. Bye guys!